follow up to, to Sean's question about the difference between writing for radio versus writing the book. I mean, surely one of the burdens of writing for the radio is a deadline every week. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, whereas with a book, if you're just in a bad mood, well, piss on it. I'm just going to drink beer today. Yeah. Does, <coughs> does that make a difference to the pleasure of writing a book versus the the burden sometimes of writing for radio? I feel like, yeah, like a book is treated very differently in the world than something as ephemeral as like a radio show or whatever. There's more of like, uh, things are set up, you know what I mean? There's launches and uh, festivals and things like that. Um, so I sort of like, I feel a little bit like I'm taking it in stride. Um, uh, but yeah, like, I mean, in terms of like having a bad day, I mean, it doesn't take much. Like, in fact, I mean, the joy of working actually in, in an office at the CDC is like, if I'm working at home and I was writing and the, you know, the printer would break, that, that would be it. I mean, it would be enough to get me like curled up in a fetal ball on the floor and take a nap. Um, but you're too embarrassed to do that, like in a public office, you know, so, so that's good. Um, and what was the, uh, freedom with the book versus the right the so much freedom i mean yeah that like i mean i was theoretically writing it since uh you know like for quite some years actually um and uh and yeah i mean it could you know it could stretch on i got like when i i think it was i did the story of noah noah's ark for wiretap and then it rejuvenated me and i i felt like you know i can do more of these and then i wrote a whole bunch over the summer and finally like was able to call up the, the publisher and say, yeah, I think, you know, we can impose a deadline and everything, so, yeah.